Are you looking for new opportunities in the technology industry? Stay tuned to find out uh, more about open positions for CNC machinists, welders, painters and mechanics at RD Group in Finland. You can participate by sending us questions via chat wherever you are watching the broadcast. Some of the questions will be addressed to the discussion and rest in the chat. Uh, if you have to leave in the middle of the broadcast, please check the recording afterwards in telive.fi. During this broadcast, uh, we will be hearing about the job opportunities at RD Group in Eastern Finland and what you need to know regarding the area and moving here to work. Uh, first, we will be starting with members of RD Group to discuss the company as a workplace and what they have to offer. And then we'll move on to discuss about integrating into the area. And lastly, we'll hear a few important things about mobility services. But now let's begin by watching a brief video about RD Group. Welcome to the broadcast, uh, plant director Jussi Martikainen and production methods designer Nasko Koliarov from RD Group. Jussi, let's start with you. Uh, RD Group cons consists of three sub-companies that are Depomix, Ratesteel and RD Technology Center. And you have plants in the municipality of Vierema as well as the city of Kiuruvesi. Uh, Jussi, could you tell us a bit more about what these three sub-companies do in practice? Yeah, so Ratestil Oy does welding and painting and Depomix Oy is machining company and RD Technology Center where we have welding, painting and assembly. You see how many people do you currently employ? It's about 150 today. Uh, well, you see, how many people are you now looking for and into which positions? Yeah, we are looking about five welders, two to four machinists, five assembly workers and a few painters. And are these open positions you see in all three of your sub-companies? Uh, yes, uh, only assembly workers go to RD Technology Center, but others is, and uh, machinists are from Depomix. Well, Nasko, um, how long have you worked at Depomix and how did you end up working there? I worked uh, from 2013 to this moment and everything goes well. Usually it's morning and evening shift. How did you hear about the job opportunities at Debomix, Nasco? Uh, actually, it was uh, from one agency. They offered me contract, and it started like that. Well, uh, Nasco, what sort of positions have you had at Debomix? Uh, what has your work been there been like in practice? Uh, I worked uh, with horizontal and vertical milling machine and sometimes on the rates it depends on the needs of the company. Uh, Nasko, did you have any other sort of work at Depomix when you started? Uh, actually my main job it was like a CNC machinist. 
Yes, sir. could you tell us about uh, what kind of working hours and shifts you do there? Yeah, our working hours is eight hours per day. We work in two or three shifts and uh, we work at from Monday to Friday. We don't work at weekends. Nasco, could you tell us like what is your normal working day like? Well, usually starts with reviewing my email and depends on that. I start to make a plan actually how it will go in my day. And what sort of uh, tasks you may have during your day, Nasco? Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, what sort of uh, working tasks uh, do you have during one working day? What do you do in practice uh, after starting your work? So it's uh, basically looking the drawings, new tools uh, for our part uh, helps to my colleagues and start to improve the working process when it's possible. Uh, well, you see, uh, what are your expectations uh, regarding applicants' training and working experience? Well, uh, attitude is the most important thing. Every everything else comes after. If you want to work, that's that's pretty enough for us. Well, uh, you see, do you have any other wishes about the applicants' skills or personal aspects? Uh, well, not really, but it's maybe we have a task for everyone. I think that if you it, it's if you want to work, then we can make something. I I guess. Well, you see how physical is the job. Uh, can, be, can there be like some uh, health issues that would be an obstacle uh, for working at RD Group? Yeah. Well. Uh, uh, some of the works are physical, yeah. but for example, machinists are not that physical. You have to stand, but uh, you don't have to lift or something like that. Uh, so it's not very physical, but something. Some you have to do something, but not 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 much. Nasco, who would you say could be suitable? for these jobs, what kind of future workmates uh, you are hoping to get from this recruitment process? I hope to see people who is highly motivated to work and uh, to be possible to work independently and to have a positive attitude. How would you describe your working community in general? Uh, how is the working uh, group that is a mix of Finnish and international people? Yes, we are a mix. There is a Finnish and people from other countries. And usually everything goes pretty well. Well, you see, you do have a quite a multicultural company. Can new workers manage entirely with English when starting and working at all your three sub-companies? Or do, does one need to learn Finnish immediately? Now you can manage in English very well, and uh, many of our employees doesn't know Finnish yet, so it's it's okay. You can speak English. Well, you see, how do you take care of the onboarding process uh, when new workers start in the job? Well, it depends the worker how can he work, but uh, it's. Usually they go with someone else who knows to work and depends on the task. It's a couple of weeks to months to learn that. And then when he or she is ready, then he will be independent. Nasco, how well do you feel you get by with English at work? Uh, very well. It's actually when you know what to do and when you understand uh, your job, then everything is okay. Nasco, how happy have you been with how everything has been organized when you started and now later on in your work? 
uh, everything is okay when I started. Uh, it was organized well and with the time it's go better and better. Uh, Jussi, let's then uh, talk a bit about the salary. What is it like in these open positions? Yeah, it depends depends on the applicant, but it's something like 10 euros and that's all. It begins with 10 euros per month, per hour. Well, Jussi, uh, do you have any sort of benefits to offer to your employees also? Yeah, we provide healthcare and washers and uh, some uh, of day relaxations and uh, some events that we manage after this Corona episode. You see, is there a possibility to try different things and advance in one's career at the RD Group? Yeah, absolutely. We have uh, many positions where we can move if it's not what you want to do and uh, if you want to go to welding and uh, it's not your job we can try machinist painter assembly there are many many possibilities nasco how have you experienced vierma as a place to live i like vierma it's a very nice place to live people are nice and i like that place Nasco, how is it uh, compared to the place where you lived in your home country? Uh, actually, it's uh, pretty same. It, there is not big differences between uh, here and my living place in my country. Yeah, so quite an easy transition then. Um, do you get by with English on your free time also in the area? Yes, I always use English language. Uh, you see, uh, how does the future of RD Group look like from the perspective of a job seeker? Well, we have a very steady job, so uh, it looks very well. We have a lot to do, lots of work, and I don't think that it's going to end near soon, so it's a steady environment. You see, what would you say are the most important things for you as an employer? It's the idea. You want to work. That's, <laughs> that's pretty much it. Everything else goes by. Let's uh, look into some of the chat questions here. You see, is there any possibility that the painters may work by airless paint sprayers? Uh, sorry, I don't understand the question. Uh, there is somebody asking that, is there a possibility that the painters may work by airless paint sprayers? I don't know. <laughs> so, you have to look into that. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know that uh, English word. I'm not sure what, what does it take. And there is somebody interested in uh, which uh, CNC machine do you use, Jussi? Yeah, I can answer and ask also, but it's Masak and Masatrol. And we have one with Fanuk, but uh, most of them are Masaks. And uh, do you, Jussi, want CNC operators at the moment? Yeah, yeah. Many. And here is one also, I am a LGBT person. How does your company feel about sexual minorities? Yeah, every person is for us uh, the same, as you can say. So we are, we are very happy to take yep. every, every people to us. Nasko, you worked uh, in a similar field in your home country also. How are all the machinery and also uh, using English in your work? Is it the same as it was uh, when you did similar jobs in your home country? Yes, it was almost same. The machine menu, it was in English language. 
so it wasn't uh, any differences for me between my country and when I moved to Finland. And you see, uh, if an applicant is wondering about um, how flexible you are with your working hours, you mentioned you never work uh, weekends. Uh, what about uh, holidays? Are there room for to be flexible there? Yeah, yeah, we have a flexible behavior about those holidays. I think that in most cases we can uh, discuss when we are going to keep those holidays because usually everyone wants to keep holidays when their children is on holiday and it's yeah it's quite flexible yeah nasco why would our viewers uh, why would you recommend for them to take action and apply for these jobs at rd group because uh, rd group it's very nice place for work and there is many opportunities for job and career. How about you, Jussi? Why would you recommend to apply for the jobs at RD Group? Yeah, I, same as Nasco, and also that we have, a, we all already are international environment, so you don't have to think about those that can you manage with English or do we know how to manage with English speaking persons or not. Finnish people because it's it's we do it every day and we welcome you. <laughs> Thank you, Jussi and Nasko. Uh, you can still send us questions. Jussi will uh, still answer them in the chat. Uh, in the chat, you will also now find the job ads. Please save these links for later. Uh, next, we will be hearing about integrating into the area uh, in North Savo starting with a brief video. Kiuruvesi on paikkakunta Pohjois-Savossa, jossa on monipuolinen elinkeinoelämä, yrittäjämyönteinen ilmapiiri ja mahdollisuuksia teollisuudelle. Alueelta löytyy eri alojen työpaikkoja ja erinomainen ympäristö elämiseen. Pienempien yritysten verkosto on Kiuruvedellä kunnan kokoon nähden suuri. Esimerkiksi erikoisvähittäisliikkeitä löytyy paljon asukaslukuun nähden. Hyvä palvelutarjonta tuo asiakkaita kiuruvedelle kauempaakin ja digitalisoituminen luo yrittäjille uusia mahdollisuuksia. Kiuruvedellä asuminen on yrittäjille ja työntekijöille sujuvaa. Asuminen on kohtuuhintaista, nauttipa sitten omakotitaloasumisesta maalaismaisemissa tai kerrostaloasumisesta keskustassa. Varhaiskasvatuspalvelut ovat erinomaiset ja pienemmille lapsille on monipuolisesti saatavilla kunnallisia ja yksityisiä päivähoitopalveluita nopeallakin aikataululla. Kiuruvesi on hyvä lapsiperheille ja ympäristö on ihan huikea. Että täällä on hirveän hyvät mahdollisuudet harrastaa, luonto on lähellä, antaa justi mahdollisuudet kaikkeen vaeltamiseen ja, ja on toki myös jääkiekkoa ja lakapalloa kaikkea. Kaikki on tässä aika lähellä keskusta-alueella. Kirjasto ja kulttuuritalo järjestävät monipuolisesti tapahtumia teatterista musiikkiin ympäri vuoden. Kuorevirran alueelta löytyvät urheiluhallit, frisbeegolfrata ja tekonurmi. Kiuruvesi. Elämän iloa Luomusuomen pääkaupungissa. Now, welcome to the discussion Tuula Parkkonen Suhonen from the city of Kiuruvesi and Tanja Manner from the career coaching company Springhouse. Tuula, let's start with you. As we already know, RD Group operates in North Savo, Eastern Finland, in Vieramal municipality, as well as the city of Kiuruvesi that are located next to each other. Uh, let's start with the specifics. What is the population of these two areas? Yes, uh, in Vierema area lives about uh, 3,500 inhabitants and at the Kiuruvesi area lives about uh, 700 and 500, uh, 700 and, uh, sorry, 7,500 inhabitants. 
Well, Tuula, uh, Kiuruvesi and Vierema are located an approximately 30 kil kilometers away from each other and from the sub-region capital of Iisalmi. Uh, Tuula, what is the distance from this area to the region capital of Kuopia and uh, to the, uh, also to the capital city of Helsinki? Yes, it is uh, the distance from here, Kiuruvesi, to Kuopio capital is about 120 kilometers and the, to the city capital of Helsinki it is about 500 kilometers. Tula, we just saw a video about Kyrvesi and heard Nasco's experiences in living in Vierema. Uh, what would you say are the biggest similarities and differences about these two areas? Well, let's start about the nature. Nature is clear, fresh, and uh, we live close to nature. And, and live is very, how can I say, freshless. Uh, you can let your sil children go out, play, play outdoors alone. And, and uh, here we have very good uh, healthcare possibilities. Shops are clear. And of course, the early early childhood care is excellent and you can educate you and your children how uh, high you want because of this this connection uh, by by uh, digi systems are a low so wide range of possibilities tania you represent a project called attractiveness attractiveness through international experts uh, that can help people that are applying for work at RD Group from abroad. Uh, what are these free services that you offer in practice? Yes, my, my, me and my team, um, we are providing guidance, support and help uh, for employees and for employers. Um, and all, during the whole recruiting process, meaning um, when you're uh, still abroad, you can contact us and we can help you um, if you have questions regarding your moving process, um, regarding Finnish society, um, the working life, um, re regarding the region, um, the housing process. Um, and also if you are um, still in, in, in the process in uh, applying for, if you are for a non-EU a non -EU citizen for a residence permit as well. So we have lots of different information and please feel free to contact us. Tanya, what about after the applicants have moved to Finland to the region and started work? Uh, how can you help them in practice? Um, for example, if you uh, have to register, um, everyone who is new in the region of course has to register at the data um, population system, um, at the tax office uh, for healthcare service, healthcare services if you have a family with you and um, your children have to register at school and and um, daycare so together with Tula um, and um, the employer we are um, there for for your help and support you and can go through the whole process together with you well, Tanya, if the applicants have families and are planning on bringing them along to Finland, uh, can you he also help their spouses in integrating into the area in some ways? Yes, of course. And this is a very important thing because the whole family has to integrate and to be uh, welcomed. And um, in our project, we have also a career guidance and we can help to find a job in the area and um, with CV trainings, etc. We are also organizing matchmaking events and um, we have our own international talent pool so employers may contact us and we can help these uh, spouses to get into work and also provide uh, information about Finnish language learning um, but as well about jobs uh, where you can start with English language. Well, Tuula, are there any public services that Vierema and Kiuruvesi offer for immigrants in these areas? Yes, we have, of course. We have um, uh, Upper North Savo immigration services. And of course, we have also our own interpreter who speaks, for example, uh, Russian language. And 
I would like to say that, of course, always we get translation helps. That's not the problem in this area. This is organization, organized already. Tula, what kind of job possibilities the area offers for the spouses of the people applying for RD Group? Uh, this, this is very, how can I say, wide range of possibility, possibilities because we have so many uh, jobs for poses open. Pro, for example, nurse, practical nurse, early sidehold education, kitchen services, agricultural interleaver, of, of course, in industry also. It depends on yourself what you want to do. For good person have always a job waiting. Tanya, what kind of practical matters should the applicants consider before and during the process of moving to Finland for work? Of course, you first uh, should agree with your employer on a work contract or a fixed agreement before coming here. And as we are still living in COVID um, um, pandemic, uh, it's good to check in advance what are the regulations um, from the Finnish uh, officials and um, so that your moving process is smooth. And you can already um, contact us and ask about um, the uh, school system so that your children are getting a good start, um, that you know it in advance. You, and if you want to check for an apartment in advance, this can be t taken care of. And um, together with the employer, we can, uh, if needed, also so, um, provide um, Finnish uh, society trainings and working life trainings for you so that you know in advance a little bit or you can ask us also questions directly via email. You get in advance already information how everything is working. It's not so, as we heard earlier, it's not so different um, from other countries, but always there's something maybe interesting you want to hear uh, in advance. Uh, well, Tanya, at what point ex exactly uh, should applicants contact you and how? This was already asked in the chat. Um, you can contact us uh, at every time already now um, during your whole recruiting process. Um, and per email, maybe it's the most uh, uh, easiest way. Um, I think there will be our contact details now in the chat um, on our website. Um, so the project name, the short Finnish name is Veko. If you see this name, it's it's us and the Springhouse is the company. And um, then we can agree on when we are in contact, we can also agree on a, a video meeting. But, and any anytime, please contact us. Tanya, uh, <clears throat> why should people choose North Savo, Finland for working and living? Um, there are many reasons. Uh, Finland is a very safe and stable country from many perspectives and uh, we are also chosen for being the happiest people in the world many times. Um, there, uh, the nature, as we heard already, is clean and um, here you have four seasons in our region. So you can winter time you can go skiing, icing and in summer we have lots of lakes here. You can go for fishing, for swimming. And you have all uh, services, as Tula said already, uh, nearby, very good services for your children and, and for spouses and for health care and cultural life and so on. Tula, what do you say? Why should people choose North Savo as a place to work and live? I would like to say this is a great place to live. We have, uh, uh, here you can uh, play different kinds of sports. Culture is very rich and for concert and theater and so on. You can do here whatever you want and what, are, what you are interested in. And of course, we have very uh, diverse uh, business life. And, and, and here we have very uh, safe to live, as Tanya said. And, and it is depends on you, what you want and how you want to live. Please welcome here. Thank you, Tuula and Tanya. Uh, you can still send us questions 
Tuula and Tanya will, uh, as well as Jussi from RD Group, still answer any questions in the chat. So please feel free to ask any questions from Jussi, Tuula and Tanya. Uh, also remember to save all the useful links that we have shared in the chat and check for more information about the discussed topics uh, after the broadcast. Next, we will be hearing uh, briefly about mobility services that can help you with moving abroad for work. But let's first watch a brief video about Finland. Uh, welcome specialist Samuli Miettinen from URES and International Employment Services. Uh, Samuli, what is URES and how can you help our viewers that are interested in applying for work at RD Group in Finland? Thank you, Emma. Uh, URES or uh, European Employment Services is, um, is um, a cooperation network uh, formed by about 1,000 uh, specialists or advisors around the Europe and so we have big team, a lot of lot of advisors, and also we have a big amount of uh, different kind of services uh, for job seekers and uh, employers as well. Um, uh, basically, uh, in, in this this case, if you need any kind of guidance or uh, any information about vacancies or living in the area or something like that, I'm also here to help you. Tanya mentioned already a few things people should consider when moving to Finland for work. Uh, what kind of things you would like to add or emphasize? Mm -hmm. uh, Tanya ja Tuula, they already said much, but um, uh, so not so much to add. But I, I want to encourage to uh, job seekers to find out uh, what kind of mobility services also U.S. have. Uh, example, we have. Uh, um, a final is a, a financial support for relocation and uh, for interview trips and 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 family support etc so yeah where can one get more information about the mobility services mm, yeah we have a great websites for sure and uh, in, in this case i recommend you can always take contact to me and um, if, if you're planning to work abroad, I also recommend to contact your uh, local URES advisor. Uh, in the chat, you will now find the email address where job applications for RD Group positions can be sent to, as well as the URES website, Samuli already mentioned. Here in chat, um, Valenti wants to know if I have a family, does somebody help me to take my family from Ukraine to Finland? Yes, yes, for sure. And finally, Samuli, why is it a good opportunity to get employed and why choose RD Group for and Finland? Mm, yeah, it's a good opportunity, but I, I want to say it's more like a fantastic opportunity. Um, I believe uh, RD Group is a, it's a company with a bright future ahead and also timing is perfect. They have now a lot of vacancies. And also we have a great team with uh, Tula and Tanya, so I, I, I promise that we will do everything that you will enjoy your new life and living and work here in, in our area. Thank you, Samuli, and thank you for watching and participating actively. Uh, we will be keeping the chat open for a few minutes uh, after this broadcast, and we will still answer any questions you may have during that time. Uh, if you joined us in the middle of the broadcast, please check the entire recording afterwards on telive.fi. And please don't hesitate also to give us feedback via the link in chat. Now, until next time, have a great day.